Hey everybody, welcome back to the Binding Rising Repentant, or From Zero to Hero series. On the last one we played as Kane, and we had kind of a cursed run, honestly. We had, like, no damage upgrade for the entire run. The only thing we really got was, like, luck upgrades and health. We went all the way to Shoal, and I just slowly died. It was kind of like the story of runs like that. It might have been easier for me had I gone to the, uh, the chest rather than the dark room, but I needed the damage upgrade from the negative. Like, it was like, oh, one damage up with the negative. So, needless to say, bit of a disappointing run. Probably could have still played it a bit better, but hey ho. Either way, I'm back with Kane. Let's try and actually achieve something this episode. Now, to do that, I do need a little bit of, you know, help game. It's like, you help me, I'll help you. Like, I'll unlock the post it note. And what do I ask in return? You know, maybe Mum's knife, no. Honestly, just. Like anything. Just some form of like nice damage. Even stuff like meat would, you know, have gone a long way on that last run. Like I don't want to be in the end game with like five damage. The other like unfortunate thing was the other damage upgrade we did I guess have was that we took Razor with us. So I was trying to use my extensive amount of HP to uh, you know give myself some like form of damage. The problem with that was that I didn't have any Red Heart synergy, so I was basically just trading away my life for damage. Per room. Which, you know, that's not a great deal. So, you know, you can give me a run like the last one as long as you give me, then, some way of regaining health. Yes, you did give me prayer card game, I remember that. But we weren't going to take prayer cards through the entire game, because I wouldn't be able to pick up the Razor then, would I? Uh, restock, that's interesting enough to consider. Now I do need a little bit more fiscal help. Again, game, if you to give me three more coins, I'd be happy to take them. I could blow up some pots. I only have one bomb though, so I'd rather save it right now. Also, the pots are probably a better pay out with two. I guess the only positive that came with the last one, by the way, is we did donate some money to our donation machine, so... It wasn't like we completely, like, whiffed. But on the post-it note side of things, yeah, we just completely whiffed. We've lost nothing. Hey, two more coins. Tears. Tears up, I'll take it. Okay, kill the enemy first, stop getting, like, greed. You know what? Spider Revenge would actually be really nice with the Razor, so if you want to give me the Razor again, maybe I'll, I'll mess about with it. Uh, I feel like this is the secret room above me, but I don't really know that for certain. Come on, Kane. Kane with his little bump on the head. I'd say it's a bump on the head, it's probably a bite, isn't it, from the spider? Maybe I don't want to think about what the art actually represents, now that I think about it. Uh, I'm going to blow up a pot and try and get the secret room. One more penny. Speed up. Health up. Okay, I found pills. Not, not awful. Hey, that's more money. I'm gonna kill. Speed up. Speed up. Nice. Okay, so what makes restock pop? Restock pops if I can get any money synergy. In fact, I like this item too, but let me just buy that for now. If I can make one more coin happen as well, then I'll buy a spirit heart and protect my red heart to the next floor. But I felt a bit slighted by devil deals in the last run, I'm not gonna lie. I got some incredibly like low percentage ones. But you know. When Razor is the best Devil Deal item you see in three Devil Deals, you know, you just. The writing was on the wall. Uh, I'd rather not take damage to Trooper Flies. Or the Champion Variant. In all honesty, all enemies that look like the Trooper Flies to me. I don't know if this is actual Trooper Flies or what his variants are named. But it, it basically does the same thing. You know, shoots tears, shoots flies. I think actual Duke of Flies just has flies. But 
All we have to do is a little bit of pruning every now and then. If you have like a spare bomb, this wouldn't be a terrible time to use it. Even just to break the rocks. Can you stop? Okay, let's go a little bit aggressive. Uh, if I'm too aggressive, I'm gonna get hurt for it. <laughs> Never mind. Flies, I kind of hate you. Could you consider not making that terrible noise? Actually, I'll pick the rotten half up to give me some flies too. My flies versus your flies. Infestation versus infestation. Uh, not great. But could be worse. Uh, I'm not going to get any more money, so let's just go down. Important we play well on this floor. This is like the most important floor. To seed the devil deal. I was going to say, am I just going to instantaneously run into a spider now? Maybe. Uh, yeah, sure. That was a bit dangerous because it was bad trip that does cost you devil deal, I think. Let me peep the shop. Remember we have restock. Restock has changed as well since base eyes. It's, it's been nerfed. It used to just like... Oh, that's a piece of it used to just give you uh, the same item over and over again. It would just restock it for like the same amount. It now increases in price. So like if I bought the Spirit Heart, and I think it's a set percentage. If I bought the Spirit Heart, it would cost me like, I don't know. Is it like 25% more each time? So it would have cost like a penny or something more or two pennies more. And then, you know, it just like steadily goes up and up and up and up. Again, it was to try and stop the combo because you could get infinite combos from restock. Uh, help. Thank you for breaking that sap. Okay, just focus for a second. Kill sap, kill spider. Kill spider, kill sap. Right, we get a demo deal. We get a DPS up as well in the next one. I'm gonna go for angel deals, I've decided. Uh, we're gonna do this Oh, still. I'm a little bit behind boss rush and I wouldn't mind doing boss rush. The ideal for like, these runs is to get boss rush and like, Satan out in the same run. Kind of hard to do though. Uh, can you please blow up over here? I wonder what this rune is. Honestly, I'll trade it. Okay, it was just Adam Zeus. Uh, you know what? I'll just pop it. Let me see where everything is. I will use blue. That might use my one bomb for this. Okay, that was worth. That wasn't worth. I should have been a bit more careful with where I placed that as well. You know, I didn't get my full value. Right, I can't get into the secret rooms right now, or into that room, which isn't too useful for me right now, admittedly. Uh, you know what? I wouldn't mind a bomb item game. It's not a bomb item, but I'm still not too upset. Uh, I can't get the tinted rock. I can't get a lot of things on this floor, actually. Are the bombs in the shop? Because I'm right by a bomb. No. Oh! No is the answer still. Okay. Okay. I can't remember if you need to bomb this twice. Yeah, you have to bomb it twice. Ooh, we got unlucky. I was hoping the chest would give me a another bomb. Oh my god, you sneaky, sneaky little boy. Okay, we just leave. Again, kind of missed out on a bit of opportunity cost there, but the only way I can think of doing it was to not bomb the, the red chest. Give me another key and I'll do that. I could go into the first room and hermit out as well. I was thinking of opening the two chests up and then hermiting. Again, a bit risky to open up two door chests rather than, you know, just open up your item room and shop. What are we looking for this run? What are we looking for right now? So, restock. Restock, if we get infinite money. How do we get infinite money? Something with the arcade could be nice. Maybe we get a synergy where we generate red hearts and we get... Uh, IV bag. That is a potential way of doing things. And I have an advantage for taking damage, so maybe that is what we're looking for now. It's a bit slow, so I guess I shouldn't worry about boss rush. If we're going to make this dream happen. 
Uh, where are you going? Oh yeah, you have two keys. We'll clear this room again. Send some hair. Okay. Not gonna lie, I'm not proud of what I did then. Okay, that's basically unforgivable. Although, speaking of which, I'll go in the curse room now. I think I'll hold the paperclip. Oh yeah, I had paperclip. Okay, I don't need to <laughs> Uh, I'll peep the, the room out. Maybe try and get the reward from it. If there's a hard wave and I feel like I'm going to get hit, I'll just leave. I got scared. The hermit. Dream catcher would take. Wow, we've been really lucky with fire so far. Okay, we're looking for item room. What do we want on the item room? I don't know. You know what? Give me a little chat. That's one of the pieces I think would be nice for my jigsaw puzzle that I'm building. Well, I suppose it's not a jigsaw puzzle when you know, you're actually making the pattern as well. It's like I'm building a a box, a, a Buddha box, a lovely salad and like protein and sauces. What do I need in my Buddha box? You like you, you don't want to get something like I don't know. Like, maybe like some sort of fish type thing and then put barbecue sauce in it. That's not a great combo. If you can get like some steak and some barbecue sauce, yes, that's nice synergy. That is a butter bowl synergy. Oh, my ring is so bad. <laughs> okay, little bomb. Equally, you don't want all greens. Just like some greens is nice. But you know, you want to throw in some like sweet peppers there as well. And maybe a little bit of salsa, you know, spice things up. Uh, okay, we'll fight the, the boss. I have one demon heart protecting my red health. We might get an angel deal at 30 something percent chance. Ooh, that's not going to be as good as I was hoping. It was a bit risky to put a bomb there, but I thought I could blow up every single one at the same time. It's not too much of an issue. But I've kind of got really low range right now, so it's a bit annoying to blow these guys up safely. You know. Okay, we're, we're safe now. No angel deal, some pills. Three of the same one. Oh my word. This is health. Unexpected surprise, but a welcome one. Even Power Pill is quite nice to know about. Okay, so the boss was actually a three health up. Cool. Now we definitely want a red heart synergy and we can make IV bag work. Then I guess if we're going for more synergy, Lusty Blood. You know, gain damage the more you take damage. Nice synergy there. Okay, please. Don't get trapped in the void, I guess is what I should have said. Hey, honestly, it doesn't matter if you take my red health now. Go ahead. Now, I should be protecting it, because if I do get an arcade, you know, the more red health, the better. This item feels like it's, it's like it's in the table too good, little Gerdy. You show up all the time. I mean, it's not a terrible item, it's just not good. Uh, yes, I will trade a bomb for a spirit heart. That is a good deal. I'm a half red heart, I suppose. Pins. Two of you. Get, and I think we're ready to leave. Short of finding secret room. Secret room, secret room, secret room. Where are that secret room? One could be here. In fact, will I get it with a bomb? No. Here? Yes. Uh, some sacks. Joker! Mmm. Okay. Uh, let's Joker. We do get an angel room deal. Uh, the Bible's not awful. Let's start making our Mega Station Dream Country. Okay. 
Just don't die in this fight and we'll probably go to go. I was trying to like bomb the fires and him at the same time. But you know, maybe right now don't put yourself in that difficult situation. Also let little Gurney fly every so often. He's not, he doesn't do a lot of damage, but you know, he's not negligible. Uh, yeah, Mega Satan now is probably a sorry, Mega Satan. Boss Rush is probably out of the question now, because this is gonna take me a calendar year to beat. Go, my little girly friend. And also, Angel, please do keep the seat. Well, it's one of those long angel fights, I guess. I suppose I am only on the third floor. Uh, I'm lucky that wasn't the dagger attack because I think I would have got hit. Yeah, that's the one. Good double hit from a little Gertie. Nice. TP's obtained. I'm confident enough that I'm going to get more bombs on this one that I'm going to do this. Okay. Fair. It does mean I'm not going to get my secret room now. Uh, I could also go and pick up the pennies from back here. Because I have the Bible. Fly, you fool. Is that a good use of the Bible? Eh. I guess it's not a bad use of the Bible. Okay, we're out. I guess there's a debate whether or not three spirit fires is actually worth not finding the second secret room for. Okay, arcade. There is a blood bank in here as well. This is interesting. I'm just trying to think of what the correct play to do this is. Do I play this? Do I spend money to make money? I think it's the question. I think we, we will. That's fine. Some consumables is nice. Hey, that's really nice. What are you learning from this so far? Gambling is good. Okay. Uh, maybe I should have gone in the curse room before I picked up this half spirit heart. Oh well. Chances are I'm not going to keep it for, you know, the entire floor. I'd like to because I'd like to get a 60 something percent chance of an angel deal. What did we even get in that angel deal? I don't remember. Was it a spirit heart or something? Or was there like a chest in there? Was there an item? Did I just not pick up the item? I don't remember. I guess it shows you like how much like I pay attention to what's going on. Uh, you know what? I'll take the Mr. Mega. I would like a few more bombs. I'm not against doing runs as well where, you know, I use my bombs for damage. And this is definitely an item that improves that build. You know what, just stop shooting. We'll, we'll get you slowly but surely. Even if it's one shot at a time. Let's come back to two rooms and use the Bible. To give me some more money. Money, money, money. Let's go out this way, actually. Uh, I regret my decision instantaneously. This is probably why we're losing that spirit heart. Yeah, there it goes. Ah, and there goes my angel deal chance. You scumbag. I'm getting a little bit of a flashback to the last run, I'm not going to lie. We have had a DPS up this run, but we're still pretty weak. Right, I'm going to play this a little bit more. That's kind of scary. <laughs> Hematemis is not what I was looking for at this moment. Empty room, sure. Uh, let's go to the small room, I suppose. I am only on two health now. Two health, not a lot of HP. I don't know if you knew this. Okay, we killed the creep guys. Hey, three HP. Three HP, more HP, which is pretty good. 
Let me just remove my phone for a second from the equation. Bomb this. What, eventually one of our pills is going to be bad, but so far they've been pretty good. I'm going to blow this uh, nerd up as well for a little bit more angel room chance. Uh, and let's keep going. We just need to play a little bit better right now. Uh, would I take shoot the wood? Yes. Over the Bible? 100%. Oh, right, come on. It's kind of weird as well, like one of the things that's hurting me a lot right now is my range is so low. That I have to get close to enemies and it's, I think it's making me take more damage than I otherwise would do. We can play ourselves out of this mess. Hey, shoot the whoop, we'll take it. Why do we take shoot the whoop? Shoot the whoop lets us play rooms faster. Clearing rooms faster is really good. Uh, by the way, do I think I get more than three cents out of buying a red heart? I think I do for the chance of getting IV back. Although, do I want IV back now that I've got Shoot the Whoop? Ah. Ah, I don't like this uh, thinking. But yeah, you saw uh, Breeze up there, that's four now. I mean, we could get uh, Blood Bag, of course. Would I take Blood Bag? Yeah, of course I would take Blood Bag. That's pretty solid. I think we get less out of it, because otherwise, you know. It'd be a way to go pseudo-infinite. I, I'm hating the, like, the noise of the big guy. Kind of curse. Ooh. Shoot, dude. You lived a lot longer than I thought, considering I had shoot dude here. Uh, again, we're just going to use shoot dude basically off cooldown. You know, it only has a two room charge, so. Let's get the most out of this bad boy. I could save it for the boss as well, but I don't really care. It, it probably gets its best advantage in rooms anyway. That being said, if I can charge up one more for the boss, I will. Right, come on, spiders. Ooh, you fight a lot quicker than I thought. Hmm. Uh, okay, I'm glad I have a super good charge. Are you immune to explosions? I always forget this. Let me just try it out. No, you're not immune to explosions. Help, I'm trapped in the corner. Hey, a damage up for the first time in this recording session. I guess it was a negative. I just had a raw damage up. By the way, let's find the second secret room. I think it might be here. I'm gonna blow it up. Great time to get a gold kick, you know, when you're just finishing the floor. I found the secret room as well. Okay. I think there is a risk play. What's the risk play? The risk play is that I play the the blood bank until like half a red heart and hope to get HP back. Then we play this. Because I'm hoping I might get a nice pill or something from this. Or a nice card. Or a lot of money. Okay, now that that's blown up, we'll play this guy. Okay. I'll take some bombs. Don't ever tell anyone that I don't try my hardest to like make some weird runs happen. Before we leave as well, if I can't do any more, we should blow up the blood bank. I'm hoping this guy just pays out. If he pays out, he'll pay out with scaffold eventually. Which is okay. 
into the gold cake. Terrific. I guess at the very worst, oh, this is what, what we want to win. Never mind. At the very least, we're game more consumables. It is scattle. Didn't get it. Which honestly is good. Hey, there's some red hearts. Scuffle again. Nope. <laughs> some more keys. You have one more penny to live. Last penny. Hey, it's not your last penny anymore. Okay, not what we were after, but we'll take it. I'll give you one more penny. I'll give you two more pennies. Hey, you've been a gent, but unfortunately... Ooh, Ed had other ideas for you. Not me, I didn't blow him up. You can't prove that. Anyway, let's go. So, at the very least, HP bag, I guess, gave me some red hearts, gave me a HP up, and it's made me faster. I now have 1.9 speed. Which is pretty rapid, honestly. We've got a bunch of bombs. 16 bombs is nice. You know, finding secret rooms, just doing generic damage. Uh, you know what? I've decided the money's not worth it. This I'll do. Okay. You shall not pass. A bomb for two bombs, good deal. How do you like being brimstone, by the way? Demon Judgment could be nice. Nordleaf makes this run, in theory, like, unlosable if I can get a damage source that doesn't rely on my tears. Let me just wait to play you. Okay, maybe I'll play you for a second. Because then I can p actually pick up red hearts. And I'm going to get a bunch of spiders. Nope. One more time. Okay, never mind. Uh, Spirit of the Night is really nice. That's flight. So we we definitely gained a benefit there. I've also got now an army of spiders. I'm also going to change Rock and Penny. Okay. The run is going in a different direction. We're now the fly boy. Or the insect boy. If I can pick up pennies. Oh, by the way. I'll get flies now. If I get hit, I generate spiders. They are two items I would really like. I don't think I want to blow up my donation machine for either. Which one are we taking first? We're going to take carrot cloth. The sun. Hey, 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 the sun is very nice. I have 100% angel deal chance right now. Oh, I made a little mistake. <laughs> I forgot I had mega bombs. Okay. That, in theory, means we can't lose the run anymore. That means we could respawn as Lazarus. That means take one of these will call money. You know what? We should just drop a bomb on every single boss. It's so much damage. Uh, I say that it means we can't lose. We can just stand still. Nord Leaf makes us invulnerable and enemies will run into our ball of bandages. Now that is the ultra tedious way of doing things and runs the problem if the boss doesn't actually you know, charge you down. You'll just get stuck in this stalemate. And often it's a stalemate that's not good for you because if you get hit, you normally, you know... You're normally worse off than the boss. About if I mean, sorry, I explained that so badly. If I just stand still like now, like the enemies crowd around me, like just generic mob enemies. So if the boss isn't taking any damage, okay. If the boss isn't taking any damage, and you know there's enemies just crowding around you, you take a hit when you come out of Nord Leaf. So it does run a little bit of a risk. Key beggar. Uh, oh my god, I, 
killing both weapons and cursor. It doesn't matter, I'm probably gonna sun. I'll play Key Beggar a little bit. Oh, I regret everything. Okay. Well, I regret walking to the curse room multiple times now. Never mind. I'll just pick this up instead. I was gonna sun. Don't need to. Bomb Beggar. I can't. Ooh. I kind of like my bombs. Okay, just coolly roll a little bit. You're just running into everything now. If I find Mumma Mega, by the way, I'll hunt and do boss rush. By the way, I'd like to blow those skulls at me. Never mind. Be a little girly pin. Why am I getting such good, like, consumable drops? I don't get it. I'll take another red heart, by the way. the eternal heart right now. I have enough money to go by 4.5 volt. Can I get into the boss? Is this a secret room? Mm, maybe I shouldn't have picked up the eternal heart. Okay, maybe I definitely shouldn't have picked up the eternal heart. Anyway, we've seen greed. This is barred off, so I can't go in there. Which is probably fortunate for my spirit heart. <laughs> or my eternal heart, sorry. It's fine, he's come easy to go. We will take 4.5 volt battery from the shop. Uh, I'll buy Red Heart, sure. Where is the other secret room? Is it here? Yes. Another bomb beggar. Is that a tinted rock at the top? I can't tell. Is it just white? I think it was just white. I do have 21 bombs. Maybe I should play the bomb beggar. Sure. Take some bombs. I did never been really impressed by the bomb beggar. Like, he trades, like, a coin for a bomb. Oh. Shows me up there, I guess. Red heart. Yeah, screw your sky. So, this is not a good trade. Okay. Uh, again, we'd like to reduce Sun, I think, for a HP up. Rather than mapping. Very good utility on the Sun card. It's fine. I didn't want an Angel deal anyway, I don't need him anymore. But look how fast Shoot the Whoop is being built up now, I guess. There's a case to be made that, you know, it's still pretty slow. So, you know, multiple shoot the uses per room. Pretty good. Especially if we can get another battery item with it. I don't know, maybe 4.5 well battery is really bad with shoot the move now that I think about it. Or just not good with it. I was expecting a little bit more, I just thought it was going to like instantaneously recharge. You weird tentacle attack. <coughs> How am I 70 odd episodes in it? I'm sorry, 70 odd episodes, that's not true for this series. I'm like 60 in. I guess it's like 60 episodes. I've done like 130 episodes on both series. Never noticed that attack until like today. Right, can you please stop using Mimic Chests? It's a bit trolly, honestly, game. Ooh, a tinted rock and a tinted skull. Do I want to do the home path? No, not really. I'm not that strong. That's a full card, in case you haven't been watching my previous episodes. Right, more bombs. Yeah, we want to fight Mega Satan, so... Let's not worry about that. Hill. Speed up. Sure, two speeds. That is fine. Let me hover over rocks and hide like a cheetah. Okay, let me get hit. 
inexplicably. Uh, Eternal Heart. We'll have to pick you up before the boss fight. Because I can't leave it. Of course, Super Greed is on our shot. I get blasted. We've had restock the entire run, and have we made it pop off? No. Okay, I'll pick that up before I go into the home fight. Spirit Heart. I have another respawn item, so I have two respawns now. One is Lazarus, and the other one is Blue Baby. Game. Can we work with each other here a little bit? I'm getting a little impatient, I just want to pop sun on this like, to see what's actually on this floor. Okay, money is useless. I guess if I went to fight push, but you know, I'm gonna fight push right now. I'm 30 minutes into this one. Double key room. Hey, we can at least donate money. Okay, not everything is lost. Up to 700 coins, still a bunch of flies as well. Oh, I say up to 700. Hopefully, let me go to 700. Nice. We did go over 700, so it's like 300 ish coins left. And I still have some other money left. Just in case I somehow find a way of using it. Leave me alone. Hey, there's a spirit heart. There's another spirit heart. That'll protect my eternal heart, hopefully. Balls of steel is next. No, that speed up is irrelevant. I just wanted to check, is this a secret room? No. Have I been to the secret room? No. Okay, I don't feel that stupid now. Is this the secret room? Surprise. Okay, not surprised anymore. <laughs> you should really check every room, but I'm trying to save a little bit of time. Where? Oh, where? Is, is it here? Secret room, where are you? Here? Okay, I'm using too many bombs for this now. It's not down there. It's in a really weird place, I think. It's like on the corner of two instead of between three. Thank you. Second secret room. Hey. Okay, a bunch of spirit hearts I cannot use. Well, I can use half of you. So that's quite a nice room. Okay. I let a little girdy fly every so often. You know, let it rip. Now a little Beyblade. Although I guess you can't call it a Beyblade item when there is an item that, you know, turns you into a spinning top. You know what? This is one of those fights where you could actually win with Northern and an Orbital. Because Mum stomps on you, so you'll always do a little bit of contact damage when she stomps on you. By the way, much better Mum fight recently. And by recently, I mean within like the last episode. You ruined my train of thought. Yeah, shoot the whoop. Get blasted. Uh, do I want to go to Shoal again? You know what? I think I do. Give me the damage up. I've only got 5.31 damage anyway. Okay, 7 damage. That's not terrible. Again, I could use Sun for mapping, but. I feel like it has a better use for me. What is that use? I don't know yet. I'm only going to do this because I've got Spirit Heart literally next to me. Okay, I found the better use for it. Make this the guy pay out. Also, you're generating a lot of red flies from my approve. Oh, were I just paying with Spirit Heart? Yeah, it's paid with Spirit Heart. My bad. I got excited. Sure, fanny pack. Uh, I'm just gonna walk up a room and so on. Give me mapping. Right, we were going the wrong way. 
which is fine. I should really go stop going in the cursed rooms in this run. Anyway, we got a decent item from that, so not all was lost there. I could have held my sun card for a bit longer too as well, but I, I definitely think I'm one of the people who gets a bit of like too good to you syndrome with items. Uh, I want to blow this guy up actually. So I'm happy just using it. Anyway, where is the fight? It's down. Anyway, my army of insects is going to deal with this. Would not mind shooting the charge again. Just for this room. Speaking of which. Bleh. Cool. Alright, I don't see any tinted rocks. Let's see what this is. Sloth. Sure. Ah, they have carrot cloth. Hero font, that is really good. It's actually too good. So I only have the ability to use, you know, three spirit hearts. Yeah, you know what? I have hero font. We'll pop hero font now. Oh, it only gives you three. I thought it gave you four. I thought it doubled it, you know, honestly. Maybe it was a nerf. I don't remember. Maybe it's always on three and I just can't remember. Uh, bom, 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 bom. Again, I don't see any tinted rocks. This fun room. I missed the button. Right, are you the second secret room? Are you the second secret room? You're not. Are you the second secret room? Yes. There's a bunch of red hearts on this floor, but there's no real reason to gain money, so I'm going to think... There! Uh, maybe I'll play Key Beggar. I don't need keys anymore. Oops. Speed up is irrelevant. You know, just save me, like, four keys. Are you joking me right now? Key Beggar. Do I run a huge risk? Fanny Pack could pay out with a red heart. What are we hoping for here? Somehow. Oh, health up is interesting. Sun card somehow? And by somehow, I guess we should blow these nerds up. You know. I should have done this first because if I get two hearts now, I can't really use it very well. I'll go pretty hard on this. Okay, not worth it for black powder. Then I'm going to pay out with one. Okay. Now I'm just going to blow you both up, unfortunately, because I would like some more red hearts. And I'll hold them to the health up pill. Okay. Come on, spell left. Shoot the whoop, not bad against him. Unfortunately, all my spiders have just like jumped onto him and you know done no damage. Can't help that. We do get a deal. And I have two spirit hearts here. Okay. So I'm willing to pay you guys. I'm going to go down to one spirit heart. Okay. That's all I'm willing to do. It's not actually quite true. I would have paid one more if I had, like, heart containers for it. I should have gone and picked up the red hearts on the floor, by the way, before I fought. I mean, we might get lucky. Maybe the door will stay open. Again, too much greed is not a good thing, but a little bit of greed, I think, is a necessity. Again, you can take that as a motto for life if you would like. Uh, give me that. Okay, I think I'm, I'm good with his health. And we'll health up when I lose a spirit heart. 
Devil Deal? Okay, it's gone. You know what? I'm not too upset by that. It also didn't give us Devil Deal precedent. Is Black Powder great? No. Why is every pill of speed uphill right now? Okay, well, there are arcades. It could have a demon judgment in it. You never know. Uh, it doesn't. I'll throw some money into this again. Why into this? I don't know. It, it can pay out with like consumables, I guess, that are useful. So the guy in the centre, like the cup guy, will only give you red hats, bombs, keys, coins, and scattle, and flies, I guess. And by flies, I mean like an enemy flag. This, I think, can pay out with like pills and stuff, red hats, consumables. I think you can get a card as well, but I could be wrong. And if it breaks, it breaks into the dollar, which gives you a dollar. Anyway. So far, pretty content with the rewards I've got off this. Uh, I'll leave the blood donation machine up, but I'm probably not going to play it, is my guess. Again, money kind of doesn't matter too much for me now. I could use it to play Angel Judgments, but... You know. That in itself has got a lot going for it. Honestly, you kind of snipe you there. Okay, we're gonna help up. I killed all the enemies. Oh, I dropped the item by the way that the, the, the trinket, sorry, that generates flies when I pick up coins. I didn't really intend to, so that's my reason. But I'm feeling pretty good about this one. You little glitchy son of a gun. 404 trinket. No. So it's a tinted rock. Nice. Spirit Heart. If I can get another deal, that's pretty good. Again, the odds are I don't get one. How did you not hit me there? I think I've given up on curse rooms. I'm not going to become guppy, so. There's not a huge value in going in them anymore. By the way, why did you not just shoot me and really walk into this room? Uh, we have gone the wrong way, and I've lost my spirit heart again. Unlike last one, I feel like I can actually kill enemies, so I'm not too upset right now. Even if I don't get the deal, it's fine. Four pennies, that's not worth going back for. I'll hold the speed up pill, I guess. I'm back to shooting groups. I hate you, worm. I love you, my big brother, big off. Being a bit of a dearth of red hearts, I'm just like, never mind. We might be playing the blood bank. Two rainbow poops in the room. That's pretty lucky. Anyway, this will generate a bunch of flies. Granny Cat will produce other stuff as well. Never mind. It'll just pay out instantaneously, it turns out. But we should save the rainbow poop because I now could trade away all my red health. And be pretty happy with it. Hey, we'll take a shot speed up. Pretty nice. Nothing incredible about this room, by the way. It's just very nice. Very solid as rooms go. Okay, I mean, not kill you. Uh, sure, I'll pick up a battery. Shoot with this nerd. Pick up another battery. Pick up a bunch of money. Uh, I don't think I'm going to go back and play the machine again. We'll take that and hold that. Steel. That's a really good pill rotation again.
Okay. So, I think I might have mentioned this before. There's a character I still haven't unlocked yet. Called the Lost. And he's a very special character. Because he's very hard to play as. His unlock condition is to get this trinket and die on a sacrifice room. And we become them. Now, currently I'm not doing a challenge that is so difficult that, you know, I feel like I couldn't do this again. And this run is incredible. So my consideration now, and by the way, I shouldn't hold health up if I'm going to do what I'm about to consider doing. I should be holding Emperor. So what I'm thinking of doing is I'm going to try and find a sacrifice room, kill myself and become the Lost. The problem with this is that the Lost, as you're going to find out, has zero HP and he cannot pick up health upgrades of any type. So he dies in one hit. Now there are things that can make the game easier for him, but I haven't got it unlocked yet, so I would definitely be in the one hit form. In fact, we played as him. If you remember when we did the looping, like the victory laps, we eventually turned into the lost. So there's no sap room here, unfortunately, but there might be on Shoal. But if I can get him unlocked, I would appreciate that, because it's like a look base character to unlock. So, you know, eventually at some point I just have to admit I'm going to sap a run. Just to unlock the loss, and then we don't have to do it again. This run is okay, it's not incredible. So we probably might... We'll lose this run, I think, if we get a sack room. But we will get an unlock. And then I'll be done for character unlock, which is pretty nice. It's not terrible either, this run. Like, there is a logic in winning this. Okay, that also kind of hurts that I just lost my angel deal chance. Get three of Oh, well. Let's pick that up and just move down. Now, I put Emperor on this floor. But I think I won't. It does kind of hurt that I've met the requirements for Mega Satan, but it's not awful. Like, I can do that again. But I think this is only the second time I've seen Missing Poster in this series. Ooh. Nice Black Handles. Black Handle and High Speed is actually a legitimate strategy. Like, I can draw, like, huge circles. And the only problem is I don't think it works on flying enemies. No, it does work on flying enemies. I always think it doesn't, but I think... I literally think I've said this multiple times now, that I think it doesn't, and then, you know, it obviously it does. Which makes sense, because it's not creep, it's, like, actually, like, a curse. I don't know what Pretty good. Eh, uh, check the curse room. Eh, uh, how about... This is incredibly stupid if I don't find a sack room. It might be stupid anyway now that I think about it because the Lost has no red hearts anyway if I do become the Lost there. But we are looking for sack room. I'm not sure if I can get a sack room on... Ah. On oh, what's his name? Well, I didn't mean to walk in here. On the dark room. I hope you can. I'm also kind of trying to not use my Emperor card to save it for the Lost. Because the Lost doing the Dark Room is much more feasible if, you know, I can just skip the entire floor. Uh, a good card could also be pretty nice. So I will probably bomb. Algis, if I can get the lost, is incredible. Never mind. Um, uh, you know what? That's pretty good. I don't know. Well, I wish I checked first. Hmm. I don't know what's better. I think the Emperor is actually better. Just for what I'm possibly going to be doing. We're going to be exploring the full entirety of this floor. I kind of hate the look of you. Oh, 
Hell yeah, I remember what you did. You're knocking my head away, which is kind of annoying. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Give me the cake. No sap room. I could also play the. Oh, I'm gonna have to play the sap room anyway. Because I'll just work in the sap room, I always forget this. Because the sap room doesn't behave like normal spikes. I think it doesn't, I think it ignores it. But I don't really want to teleport from it. Because, you know, that'd be bad if I, I didn't die on it. It's also the other reason why I'm not picking up every single red heart right now. Is that I, I need to die in a moment. That. Watch out for the scary skull angel things. What's still alive in here? I don't see it. It's these two dweebs. I see it now. Bomb. Uh, yes, damage up. Honestly, good hit. I can't be mad, but I'm a little bit mad about it. I think we're going the right way, by the way. Yeah, we're going the right way. Immediately confirms my suspicions are true. A big brother with your mind, you know. Uh, okay, I'm a little bit hesitant right now. I also don't think I can victory lap and unlock the loss, because I think unlocks are disabled when you do victory laps. So I would have to be hoping for an R key if I can't find a sap room in here. It'd be really annoying to pick up missing poster and, you know... Oh my god, there's no sap room on here. Well... We pick up all the red health then I guess and just do this as pain. And I guess I take Algis with me now? Or do I still take Emperor? Secret room. I'm just trying to think of an out here. Hmm. I think we're just gonna miss it, unfortunately. I guess I I guess I hold Emperor. It's like nothing can spawn the yeah. Nothing can spawn the air thingy. Wait, can I come back into the room? Maybe I should take Algis into the boss fight. Oh, that's kind of bummed me out a little bit, I'm not going to lie. I thought we could unlock the lost, finally. I've been look looking for it for every single run recently, but... I guess the dream has to wait a little bit longer. We'll check the entire dark room, I suppose. And there's still nice things for us. It's not like the run is like dead. Big uh, bro, could you please hurt these two guys? Thank you. When do we pop Algis? I mean, Algis would be nice for the Mega Satan fight as well, in all honesty. Thank you, Dry Baby. A little bit of extra damage, you know. Everything helps. You know what? I'm gonna hold out this, I've decided. I won't use it in this fight. I'll use it in Mega Station if I have to. That helps. <laughs> Bit of a waiting tube, do we? We're not going to Delirium. We're just gonna leave. Yes. Bomb bag has appeared in the basement. That's nice. The Mega Satan fight's gonna open. Oh my god, I forgot I took this item. <laughs> I got protected by uh, Nord Leaf. That's pretty funny. Headless baby. Oh my god, I hate that item. 
Okay, this is worth taking. That's about it. Yeah. Alright, let's explore the floor. A sun card would be really nice right now because then I wouldn't have to do this. I can't victory lap and beat Mega Satan either. I I've been truly trolled by this run. Anyway, can you, like, you know, consider getting out of your invulnerability? Uh, I think I'm two books away still from uh, bookworm. So I'm not going to pick up a book for one health that I don't like. Okay, one of the wards is off his broom. Two wards are off their brooms. Okay, I did not. I just thought you died then. I'm not going to lie. The worst thing is I can't even use a teleport card to get out of the Mega Satan fight because if I win it and it's not a delirium ball to spawn, it just takes you out of the game. Uh, please. <laughs> I'm going to check that's not a secret room and if there's a spirit heart in there. You know, I don't need 26 bombs anymore. Should do any time you'd like to charge. I'd appreciate it. Oh, I should also set up a little circle. There we go. Honestly, great hit. There you go. Enjoy that. Off that enemy, I'm not gonna lie. The wafer is incredible. So the wafer means I get less damage, basically. So whenever you take one full heart of damage, you take half a heart instead. Uh, I can fly so the doesn't bother me. Set up a you know, black powder thing. I think we have the win in the bag here. I think we'll beat Mega Satan as well. This is interesting. I'm going to take it, Trap to Beam. So it makes your tears go along an axis. But I think it'll improve my range. Please leave me alone. Fine. Good hit, honestly. Hey, here are all the items that we've been asking for for like the last two runs. I've got 11 damage now. Uh, please. Okay, a little haunt. Okay, we found the boss fight. We might as well do it, honestly. Here and now. Make sure we actually, you know, we unlock something. Well, who's a fool now? You just jumped into my black powder circle. Anyway, a key. I want to check this in the secret room. They're really hard to find, as you can imagine, on the dark room. Maybe it's up above the other one. Oh, it is. Uh, I could use algae here. In fact, I don't need 25 keys. You pay out with something. Give me something interesting, key bomb. I forgot key bomb on this floor is really good. But he just gives out chests. All chests are items. Except the red ones. That's not good. Yeah, good bag, I think. Oh well. We, we got a decent reward out of that. I shouldn't really have opened up the red chest until I'd used all my keys that I wanted to. It's still nice to save some. Anyway. Lamb fight. Okay. Can't quite tell if Shooter was actually more 
some damage to my taser. I mean, it's always a personal shot. Okay. Well, I've killed the body. It's just the head left. Really weird hitbox in this thing, by the way. Oh my god. Really weird hitbox in me as well. I'm pulling it off. Help. <laughs> Hey. Do we want a victory lap? No. No delay with to spawn here, which I think is good. Because maybe I get one on the Mega Satan fight. Either way, I'm going to try and die. I've never seen this room before. But the dopamine that just got released from me from picking up all those coins was incredibly high. Like, my dopamine channel's just, like, fully open. Phew. I've heard glass cannons have been bought, but I don't know how. Oh, I just lost my glass cannon. So, it, the glass cannon breaks now, from what I can see. Okay, I'm It did some damage to me, well, I think. And then you just have to build it up again on room charges? Is that the gist of things? I'll take glass cannon. Now, I do have to live. Remember that. Oh, I have the wave I forgot. Never mind, my health is really good. And this is the room that, you know, you get the forgotten on, but... We have it. Uh, Shoop Doop, you were really good for us, but sorry. You're no longer in my plans. I, I really don't think there's a sap room that spawns in the dark room. I don't think you've ever seen it. I don't think a sap room can spawn either in a delirium fight, so I don't know how that's going to help me. The only thing I can think of that helps me is I get Arcade. Well, I, I checked secret rooms already. Will you get out of my way? Oh, you live. Yeah, I can only think of getting Arcade. Restarting the run and dying. Hey, my glass cannon's back. I wonder how much damage that did. It feels like a lot. I'm glad it glass cannon again. Fortunately, I can recharge it. But yeah, I, I tried, viewers. I tried it all I could. Uh. We still have the Algis, which is nice. I'm going to take Headless Baby now because, you know, I don't have the HP. I wonder if I would have respawned the loss, by the way. I had two respawns. Remember having Algis Rune as well? Just have to watch out for the Mega Attack. It's like the only one that's annoying. Hey, glass cannon's back. I missed. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Take a glass cannon. Ooh, that looked like it did a lot of damage, actually. I love the noise it makes, too. That's so good. It's same as, like, the warfly thing. I should honestly do that. Holy moly, he melted him. His glass cannon was just a good item now. I never thought I'd see the deck. Oh, that goes glass cannon. Fanny pack, fortunately, is paid out with another red heart. Nice. I think slowed. Appreciate that. I would like to kill the pony thing, but I can't. It's too fast for me. Anyway, glass cannon. Okay, three HP. We are approaching the point now where, you know, I've never seen you spawn this guy either. Okay. Uh, we're getting to the point where I should use algae fairly soon. I should also just use Glass Cannon. 
It's pretty funny, it goes into my trap to even get stuck. And just follows it. Okay, I think I missed. <laughs> Please stay away, troll bombs. You know what? I'm gonna algis. This isn't quite one yet. Now that I look at things. And by the way, you can get close to the enemies. You have a lot of orbital. Okay, that, there's algis gone. Angels shouldn't be too much an issue. As long as you're not shooting. Right, one more angel. Right, I got a little bit scared then. Okay, I'm very scared now. Right, just Mega Satan versus me. Never mind. Apparently that's not quite the case yet. You're the one I'm moving for. I respawn. Never mind, we're unlocking something else. Ah! I feel like I'm Laz. Just a quick second. I have done this with Laz before, so I should probably die. But I think I'm just going to naturally die, so let's not worry about that right now. Why do you spawn in that? You stop spawning things, Mega Satan, while I'm fighting you. Anyway, I think I want to die now. Before I win this, because I've already got the achievement. So if you wouldn't mind, thank you. So I'm now blue, baby. And it spawns me out of the fight. Of course it spawns me out of the fight. We'll just do it again. I haven't done this with Blue Baby. No, I haven't. Okay, this was worth. The, the run win doesn't matter. Okay, that's pretty unforgivable. Damn it. I greeted for a penny. Like, what am I going to do with a penny in this fight? We, we can win this. I'm not proud of my display in the Mega Station fight so far. Really not proud of my display so far. Right. Horseman fight. It's so important to get glass cannon back up, it's actually a lot of my damage. There you go. Like it's one shot in these guys. Okay, there's the pony. Ah, I missed war again. I'm kind of hoping these bombs accidentally just kill that horse. Never mind. Okay, war, please leave me alone. Avoid Mega Blast. Blast cannon him again. Okay, this is going much better. Okay, not good use of blast cannon. I'm just going into eternal focus mode. How did you live with that? These guys have way more health than I thought they did. Be a little bit careful there. Troll bomb, leave me alone. Okay, we broke last cannon again, but we did get spirit heart. So not all is lost. You don't need those pennies. Just leave the pennies alone. Right, angels. Please leave me alone, angel. 
this is the harder angel of the two. Just glass cannon him. Ah, that's really bad. Really, really bad. Okay, we can't get hit again. Unfortunately, I don't think I spawned at the loss if I die in this situation. Can you please leave me alone? Again, you only have to kill the head, by the way, in case you're wondering. You don't actually have to do anything to the hands at all. It just removes some of the attack animations, I think. So I normally do it. You normally also do it just by accident. Anyway, we've got back to where we were before. I have 30 bombs as well, remember? But honestly, let's just blast that now. Oh, Glass Cannon pushes you back. I didn't even notice that was happening. Uh, this is possibly the worst attack of the lot. The dodging, yeah. <laughs> it's like the only hard attack! Anyway, we still got some unlocks there, but honestly, that was a little bit of a... A bit of a, like, scuffed ending. I think we could have won it, honestly, with... Uh, when we were last still, rather than Blue Baby. But... It's not too bad. We didn't get the Mega Satan completion with Kane. We kind of threw it in the dustbin, honestly. We didn't become the Lost, but we did do the Dark Path, so we'll do Mega Satan again at some point. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.